The Quote Goats Podcast. The Quote Goats Podcast. So I just brought up OnlyFans, right? Mm-hmm. Um, it's this little girl. She's eight. I think she's eighteen. You never seen a viral video? She's like. She's like, catch me catch outside. Out. How about that? Yeah, catch me outside. You know, How about that? No, me. I I live like in a cave. <laughs> okay, they call her the Catch Me Outside girl because catch me outside girl. she went on a show, the oh. Doctor Phil show. You know who yeah, Doctor Phil that. is? Yeah, I at least know. Okay, that. so she went on Doctor Phil and she was like one of these like really bad kids that badass like badass white kids, badass white snow out bunnies, with black people, <laughs> 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 like really like always like unruly with her mom didn't want to do what her mom said and she talked like really black yeah like ethnically like she's trying to imitate a black girl okay and uh she she was talking shit to dr phil and and to the crowd because the crowd was booing her the whole time i think she was like 15 when she was on the show i think and uh like the crowd was booing because she was like cussing out her mom and cussing out Dr. Phil. The mom was like, I just can't control her. Can't she's blah, blah, getting blah, blah. I'm afraid she's gonna go to jail because she's like what fifteen or something like that. Yeah, the time. but she was like hanging out with her hood rat friends and stuff. <laughs> and then like like I said, the crowd was booing and to the crowd she was like, And fuck y'all too. Like, catch me outside. How about that? Yeah, that's what she said and to that, the crowd. At fifteen. And that that went viral. Like somebody took a clip of that like years later oh, and no. it went viral and she blew up on the internet. They made right? a song out of it and everything. Yeah. Somebody really? made a song yeah. out of it, put it on Spotify, got millions, probably a billion views at this point. <laughs> and she took that, she took she which was smart. She took that opportunity. She was like, somebody put out a, a song with my voice and I didn't even have nothing to do with it and it blew up. And then she became a rapper. At like the age oh. of maybe 16, 17, maybe. I think like and 16. One she, of her songs have hit like Billboard. like Gucci they, Flip Flops, Gucci. maybe. <laughs> you should have put the... Come on, I should have. But we can't play music in the pod, though. Uh, it's going to get copyright stricken and shit. Oh, yeah, that's right. But um, she had a pretty successful like rap career after that. Because she was known, already known for being ratchet and shit. And um, I don't know. She, she, she got rich off of rap after that and went on a tour and... Worked with a lot of, uh, like, big artists and stuff. Wow. And uh, the whole time, she talking shit. Just, just, <laughs> she, whole, I, like, she got exactly a exactly how she was on, like, the Dr. Phil show. She yeah. Being bad as fuck. Like. And uh, the whole time, she was just waiting to turn 18, you know? Mm-hmm. And apparently, she had a lot of fans that was waiting on her to turn 18. <laughs> and the day she turned 18, she dropped her OnlyFans. Okay. And she made a million dollars in 24 hours on OnlyFans. Just turned 18. That is so inspirational. <laughs> <laughs> she's crazy. And she's not even like, I she's not so even proud a, of her. <laughs> uh, I'm sure her mom proud of her now. <laughs> and, she uh, but she's not even that attractive to me. Yeah, I mean, but she's smart. I mean, or you, she has good people. You saw yeah. what they offered like Kylie Jenner or when she turned or Kendall Jenner when she turned 18 like Pornhub was trying to get like give her like millions. I know. Millions. Probably all of the sisters when they turn like 18 they get money for her. Yeah, yeah. now it is yeah, but now at the time. But but yeah, so she made a million in one day and it's been a year since she dropped it. Okay. And she just like well, we going I'm going to play the clip you're going to see a, a little bit of how much shit she be talking. Of course, I'd rather call me the fucking youngest female of the decade to go play. Call me some shit like that. Like, there's way more things. Call me the fucking Gucci. Wait, I think that was like the middle of the video. I'm going to go back to the beginning. She is attractive, though. Okay. And no, it's not something that I'm just, oh, yes, I'm so in love with being the girl who got famous for... Oh, being on Dr. Phil and saying some crazy shit. No, that's not how I feel. Is she naked? Wait, but did you see how fucking big her teeth are? <laughs> she got them big ass porcelain veneers. It's like too big for your mouth and stuff. Yeah, they be She got the lip injections. She, does she wear something? Yeah, she Yeah, she got on like a halter, like a crop top or some shit. Okay, because she looks naked. Yeah, I think she did it on purpose, but let's keep going. So, of course I oh, rather yeah. call me Look at look at them teeth. 
<laughs> but they, she got a bad job anyway. Youngest female of the decade to go pl- call me some shit like that. Yeah, she went platinum. Call me the fucking Gucci flip flops girl, the high bitch girl, the girl who got a fucking million dollar makeup deal, the girl who made over fucking fifty million dollars on fucking only. F- Call me whatever the fuck you want. Okay, try- that's that's what I wanted. That was what I was waiting on her to say. In a year's time, she made fifty million dollars on OnlyFans at nineteen. I think she's nineteen now. At 19 years old, she just bought a six million dollar mansion, cash. Shit is od. Really? From posting booty shots on OnlyFans at 18 years old. Yeah, that is smart. The people smart. who are I can't who I can't are even watching lie. that it's are stupid, not her. Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I was getting at. Like, I don't fault her at all. Like, get your money. Yeah, that's shawty. What I'm like, that's, 50, can't 50, nobody hate on her no more for 50, 50 mil. In a year? And the thing is, on OnlyFans, there's a lot of restrictions. You can't do that porn. Like, you remember, Trey told us that. You there's no that. porn. You can't do that porn <coughs> shit. So Only it's just, naked pictures. It's just oh, literally okay. naked pictures. So but like, you can take everything, uh, right? You like can you show everything. everything. You can't do porn. But you can't show you can't. sexual yeah, acts and stuff. On it now. You can't do no porn on there. Nope. They shut it down. That's, that's You know why they, they shut it down? Because they was trying to, like, cause you know OnlyFans blew up in the pandemic like everything else? Mm-hmm. And they was trying to get corporate, some corporate money, some corporate sponsors and shit like that. And um, <clears throat> nobody wanted to do business with them because they like they got that porn stigma on them. So they was like, how can we rebrand and change? Because people don't only show naked stuff on OnlyFans, you know, like it's celebrities who show more of their life on there and people subscribe to it and pay monthly to like see like different things like people do classes on there all type of shit but it's mostly known for the porn and the naked stuff you know that's how it blew up Mm -hmm. and uh, like i said they was trying to get like corporate big time like money sponsors and shit and they couldn't because of the, the porn stigma so that's when they like they were like no more porn you can have naked pictures in a certain way but no intercourse on there no crazy fucking or you know. I mean, if she's cool with it, then I don't see any problem. Of course, she has. I mean, people will hate her, but for that money, a lot of people will love her as well. Yeah, I don't see. I have no fault in what in her doing it or the amount the amount of money she made. Like, but the thing I wanted to like point out and kind of get y'all opinion on is like the dudes that waited. That's what I was from yeah. fifteen to that eighteen. Creepy. That is creepy. That was probably, but she look man jerking she, off the look, whole look, time to her. She knew that though. I tell you why. You know when she knew. <coughs> you know when she made that plan, bro. Like that big move to do OnlyFans is because I don't think you guys remember. Like maybe a couple, like two years ago, three years ago, she. It was that one guy who slid in her D. It was like they were talking about her DMs. Okay. Like, it, it was like a celebrity. There's been a couple of celebrities that were overage saying, and she said, like, so and so sliding in my DMs and stuff like that. Oh, really? And it's the comments and stuff under to where I think she saw, like, a lot. Because I, I read the comments. A lot of the men were like, you know, 18, can't wait till you're 18. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, of course, if, you know, business wise, like, you she know, was, she's she going to make that move. That she is gonna, smart. smart. You know, smart yeah. as fuck. Like, yeah. You know? And she was already out there, so it wasn't too far fetched for her to like and she jump looks on the like only she fans. wants to do it. Like, no one forced yeah, she her. Yeah, she do. She got she was she got all the surgeries at like seventeen. She got her lips did. She got the big veneers. She got her boobs did. I think she got her ass did. Like anything you could get did, she got she it done. did. Yeah, it's done <laughs> on her. You know, like yeah. <laughs> everything and. You know, I can't even. I can't really knock her. I for can't it. knock her at all. Come on, bro. Like, no, that's like she ain't made. She ain't made. Sense. She made like two thousand. Like she made fifty million. Fifty bro. mil. Like people are really people. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong. I mean, I. You I mean she's like you know the catch me outside thing <coughs> with, with the, that era was going on. I thought it was ri- ridiculous how me too. she was acting. But I mean. That's years ago, bro. Like now, she's like, bro. She capitalized are, off of that shit. Yeah, she's the, people are mad that you know they didn't have that idea. Like, exactly. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, damn. Like you know. So of course they're gonna be like, well, she's making fifty million, but she's still that catch me outside girl that's trying to act black. But she that catch me outside girl making that fifty 
that mil. got 50 mil off of that, off of that I mean, viral she, video. She was dead anyway. So why not taking money out of it? Yeah, and it's you a lot of people. I mean, like, it's a lot of people that go viral for crazy things on the internet that yeah. that you never hear about. After um, what's his name? Boom gang? Uh, no, no, not boom <laughs> gang. He's oh. one, but uh, what's the one nigga that was like, um, and you could go and say that, homeboy. Remember that shit with the with the. Uh, he oh, broke sorry. into the house and you know he was like hide your kids hide your wives oh. you know the that? gay dude yeah he he's made like Tyrone Bigger yeah, no, he made a lot of money Bigger. he profited <laughs> he profited a lot man off that he's, he did I yeah, saw him bro. in a Madea movie I think he makes a lot of money to this day because of that he got a song too right yeah <laughs> he did his hair his hair I remember he was looking wild like he's you could tell they was in the yeah hood. he was like hide I mean, your kid people, hide people, your wife people <laughs> hate you for any kind of th things you do so but it's easier to just ignore fly that in, shit. A, in a ferrari than on a bike exactly that's why this the quote goes that's a quote right there <laughs> yeah <laughs> yo if you enjoyed this podcast you already know what to do and if you don't know what to do i'm gonna tell you what to do hit that subscribe hit the bell icon and give us a like because it's the quote go podcast man you can't you can't go wrong tune in every weekday six o'clock friday full episodes on youtube and spotify hit us up on the instagram give us topics and we appreciate it man quote goes podcast we out